Mazi Madone. Lisa! 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 Come out here. What is good about this afternoon? Now listen. You had better pay my money before I throw you out of this compound. You're not the first woman to get pregnant. Pay me my money now before people will say I, I, I did something bad to you. Sir, please, I am sorry. I have explained this to you. I, I am here to hear from my husband. Once I hear from him, I will get back to you. This I'm, is. I'm, I'm, I'm even worried because I don't know if he's okay or if, if something happened to him. Please. This is exactly what I do not want to hear. I have heard everything that transpired between you and that young man. He was not your husband. Yes. Pay me my money before we can, else I throw you out of this compound. Now that I'm being nice, you had better listen and listen for good. Because the next time I will be coming here, I will be coming here with boss to throw you out. Come to think of it. This is the only place I am getting money to take care of myself and my entire family. So, so I will be. I will be. I'm late for work. Just give me a minute to serve your breakfast. I, I, I won't be late, okay? And I said I'm late for work. Alright? That's enough. Open the gate. But I'm not done. I said open the gate. Okay, sir. Now! I said I'm coming. Cheating on me, right? Eric, you are cheating on me. You are cheating on me, right? You, you are cheating on me, right? You, Eric, you are cheating on me. You are cheating on me, right? You are cheating on me, right? You, you are cheating on me. You are cheating on me. You are cheating on me, you! What have I done to you? Just what have I done to you? Haven't I been a good wife to you? What do I do? The one that he doesn't eat my food again. He doesn't pay attention to things that he used to. I will burn you. I will burn you. I will burn you. Hello, Angel. My sister, I am not fine. I am not fine. 
They want to kill your friend now. Life is dealing with me. Life wants to kill me. Angel, I am going through a lot. I am going through a lot. I don't even know what to do. I don't know who to call. I don't know who to run to. Angel, my landlord wants to disgrace me. My landlord wants to embarrass me. He has promised that the next time he comes to this place, he's going to throw my things out. And to tell you the truth, I don't even know where to go to, where to run to. To crown it all, I am pregnant. I am sorry, my sister. I'm sorry I forgot to tell you. Yeah, with all these things I'm going through, I, 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 I don't even remember sometimes what the day is. I'm sorry. Are you serious? Ah. Ninja, you're a beautiful soul. You're a beautiful soul. And tell me why God will not keep blessing you. Tell me why God will not continue to bless you. Thank you so much, Nim. Thank you. God bless you. Okay. It's over. No problem. I will let you once. I will let you know once I'm ready. Okay. Huh. Thank God. Father Lord, thank you. At least when I get there, let me have peace. And maybe by the time this man is ready to throw me out, he will not meet anybody here. And I'm sure Angel will help me pay my rent. And his ganga is good to I'm so sorry, I was, uh, I was trying to leave the house. Eric. Yeah? You know you're playing with fire, right? I said I'm sorry, okay? I'm truly sorry. So, you kept me waiting because of that barren wife of yours. I sat down here waiting for you. You were taking your sweet time with that barren thing. Is it? Maybe it's, it's about time I pack my stuff. Should we, should we stay together? Should I move in? Babe, stop. Stop, okay? Don't say that. We had a plan. You have to stick to the plan. Once you get back, we move in. Okay? So we'll stick to it. No, we're not sticking to any plan. With the way you're acting, I don't even think we have any plan anymore. You cannot... Do whatever you like, take your sweet time and keep me here waiting. I am the one with the pregnancy, not your barren wife. Okay? Anyway, I asked you to get me things. Go and get them before it's PM. And I hope you know you're not going to work today. Fine. Right. Go, why are you still sitting? Good morning. 
Are you for the program? Oh yes, I am. Uh, are they still on? Well, I I don't know. I think it's over. Over. Uh, so why are you coming now? I'm, I'm coming from Asaba. Asaba, uh, the, the, the road, the traffic was terrible, man. Then you should have been here yesterday if it was important to you. Long story. Can, can I just go in now? I don't know. You think I should go in now? I don't know. Try your luck. All right, let, let me go. Can you help me watch my box? Um, no, sorry. I can't wait for you. I have to go. I'm going somewhere. Please, I beg you. Give me just five minutes. I'll go in. Actually, I'm very hungry. I need to go and eat, okay? So, please, please. Sister, please. Yeah? Fine. But you have to be fast. Yes, I'll be fast, okay? Thank you. So, much. so how did it go? Um, they collected my file. They said they were done for today, so I should come back tomorrow. Well, that's on you. You should have come early. Yeah. Thank you very much for watching my file. You're welcome. Yeah, I'm. Um, I'm Eric. I am Lisa. Oh, nice to meet you. Same here. You said you're hungry. Can I buy you lunch? Nah, come on. No, it's okay. I just want to buy you lunch. Yeah. And I said, no, or are you trying to pay me for looking after your bag? No, 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 don't say that. It's from my heart, actually. Eh? Please. Well, if you insist. Yes, I insist. Fine. Yeah. But are you going to be walking around with this bag? Uh, don't worry, after eating, I'll get a hotel. I have to do my bag, my bag. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Ah. This food is so nice. Yeah. When it comes to food in any way, they are the best. Uh, yeah, so I heard, so I heard. Mm. Mm? So, tell me more about yourself. I'm Eric. I'm a single man. I'm from Anambra. Really? Mm hmm. I'm from Anambra too. Are you serious? Yeah, Ufuma. Ah, what a coincidence. Mm -hmm. I'm from Mekulobia. Oh, are you serious? Yes. Wow, that's I'm interesting. Serious. <laughs> that's really interesting. Interesting, man. Mm. Interesting. So, very, very. Basically, you stay in um, Asaba, right? Yeah, that's where I stay and do some small, small business. Oh, I see. Mm. That's good. Mm. Uh, what is it? Hey, my God. Huh. What? Is everything all right? I forgot my ATM card when I was rushing. Oh, really? Um, then you should do it to the spot then. That, that's the problem. My, my app is faulty. I was supposed to go and rectify it at the bank, but I was rushing to come for this program. Oh, really? Yeah. God. Young man, do you think I don't recognize what is about to happen here? How? How? All of a sudden, you forgot your card and your bank app suddenly has an issue. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. Yes, yes, it's. It, it, it. I was supposed to go and rectify before coming to. And whatever it is you think you're going to play here, I already beat you to your game. Alright, fine. I'll just be open with you right now. Excuse you? I don't have a damn on me. I had to borrow money to come for this program. I'm just a single man who's working so hard to, to feed home. 
and as you speak, I don't even have where to sleep this night. I'm, I'm sorry, I, I got you into this. No, you should be sorry you got yourself into this. You don't have money, yet you offered to buy me food. Even when I insisted, you shouldn't. You insisted you want to take me out and buy me food. So what exactly was your plan? Huh? No, I don't need you to answer that because I already know what you wanted to do. Your plan was to go dig me, right? You've seen a young girl, somebody you can leech on. Someone. She takes care of you, take you home, feed you, bring you up. In your small head, you just found yourself a cougar, right? No, huh? it's not. Yes. Ah, well, let me bust your bubble, darling. This is the end of the road for you. Nothing is coming out from this young lady. And I'm as wise as the street. I, I, I and for it, your though. information, if you don't pay for this food, you find yourself washing plates for them. I would suggest you just quietly ask for your size of apron so you can start washing plates. Because I see you doing that already. Hello? Hello? Ma'am? Hello? Hello? Eh? Sorry, um... Welcome to my humble abode. Um, your humble abode is beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. I mean, this is just a small space I'm managing for now. It's, it's fine. Praying I pass my promotion exam. That way, I earn more money. I pray we all pass that exam. <laughs> Hey, well, thank yeah, thank you so very funny. much for everything you've been doing for me. Come on. I truly appreciate it. And I promise you, I'm going to pay you back. Hmm? Hey, can you stop saying thank you? I mean, since I've offered to help you, you've been saying thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I believe if the situation were to be reversed, you would do the same for me. I will. Uh, very, In fact, anybody. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my bad. Please, I'm sorry. Sit down. Thank you very much. Sit down. So, um... Like I said, this is my small apartment. It's a room and a parlor. So, we will manage it. Sure. Huh? Maybe I could sleep in the living room while you sleep in the room. No, you don't need to stress yourself. I will, um, I'll sleep here. I'm sure this couch can carry me. No, I would like to stress myself. You are a visitor here. You are my visitor. So, you sleep in the room more comfortable while I manage here, okay? It's all right. Anyway, I'm sure you would want to freshen up, right? Yes. I will. Okay, let me run you hot water, okay? Thank you very much. And uh, I'll show you one. I hope you're enjoying the food. Yes, it's nice. Mm. Thank you. You're not drinking your water yet. I will. Yeah, you. Open it for me. Chicken is nice. <laughs> you're so funny. Huh? 
Um, if you want more, I can get for you, okay? Let me finish this one first. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. You're welcome. So, um, sorry. Uh, what's the name again? Eric. Eric. No. Eric, I'm so sorry. So, what's the plan? Plan? Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, I hope you're not um, tired of me already. Oh, come on. That's not true. I mean, you know what? My bad. I... I think this is not the right time to ask ask this question. We'll do it some other time. I'm so sorry. Just 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 enjoy your food. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> like I said, if you want more food, I can get it for you. Mm. I, I don't think it's Here. Um. Take this. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Um, do you need any other thing? Because I'll be going to bed now. No, I'm I'm fine. You're sure you're fine. Yeah, I'm fine. Do you need anything? Yeah. Okay. Good night. But Lisa. Yes. Thank you very much. Come on, it's not right. Sweet dreams. Lisa, what do you think you're doing? You have a total stranger in your house, alone. I hope I'm not making a mistake. Hello, Angel. I, I hope I didn't wake you up. Angel, you cannot believe I have a grown man in my house right now. A total stranger. Alone with me in my house. Girl, I am telling you. I, I don't know. It's here. I did that already. Scared. I'm not really scared. I'm just, I'm not sure if I'm doing the right thing. But it's okay. I'll be fine, okay? Meanwhile, you know what? Tomorrow I'll call you so we talk about why you are still awake at this time of the night. I know you. You sleep early. So for you to be awake now, something is wrong. Anyway, tomorrow, okay? Go back to sleep. I mean, try and sleep. Good night, darling. So, um, what's your destination? Um, actually, I have no place in mind. Where do you think we should go to? Why don't we go to that restaurant we went to yesterday? Hmm? Oh, they have yeah. good food. Oh, yeah, they Their have. food is nice. They do. They then do. let's go then. Alright, let's go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right now, I'm focusing on building a sustainable life for myself. Mm. As a matter of fact, I'm having a rethink. A rethink about what? About life entirely. Why don't you tell me more about yourself? I mean, everything about you.
But well, listen, it's okay if you can't talk about it. That's fine. Oh, oh, of course I can talk about it. I mean, whatever it is, it's in the past. No, it's not in the past. Whatever it is that made you look so gloomy right now, it's not in the past. It's actually here with you. My candid advice is expel all the wrong people in your life. Reject them. Make room for new good people to come in. Hmm? My advice. Waiter! I'm not skipping this girl. What's going on? I'm sorry, sir. It's almost ready. Yes, sir. Just get ready ASAP, alright? Sorry. Thank Hurry you, sir. Up. Okay, sir. picking my calls and, uh, and replying my messages. I have told you countless times, stay away from me. No, really, stay away from me. Why are you stalking me? Why? See, see babe, you need to tell me something I need to know. No, listen, ma'am, you, you heard her. She said you should stay away from her. All right, so I advise you to stay away from her. Hey, bro. Stay away, because this is between my woman and I. Uh, uh, so stay away. Point of correction, Victor. I am not your woman. I ceased to be your woman the moment you couldn't stop lying. You're a pathetic liar. Stop disturbing me. Oh, babe, but uh, you know I lied because of our relationship. No, for the sake of our relationship. you lie because of your selfish self. And stop disturbing me. This relationship is over. It's over. Victor, stop. Please, 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 please. Let's well, go. You, you heard her. Let's she said, she said just, so. Just right. go. stay away. No, I'm not going to stay away because right now you're bugging her. So stay away. Young man, okay. please stay yes, away. It's yes, between me and my woman. Peter, what is your problem? What's this guy's problem? I said stay away from me. What is your problem? Stay away! Listen, man, I'm going to get physical with you right now. Hey, hey, I swear to God, I'm going to get physical with you right now. Stay the hell away from her. So you're doing this because of this punk? Huh? Huh? Did, did you just call me punk? Yes! What? Did you just call me punk? It's alright. But really, you should know you're not Voltron, defender of the universe. Neither are you, Jackie Shan. Eh? I, st I told you, ignore him. I know I'm not any of them, but um, I'm happy I was able to protect you from that beast. I mean, what kind of man would stalk a woman like that? Men like Victor. Anyway, I'm sorry. Let me... Let me get bound so I can massage it for you, okay? That's right. Hi. I'm sorry. I'm sure you're restless, right? Are you alright? I'm good. I'm concerned about you. Um, no, I'm, I'm fine. No, you're not. I'm sure with what you're going through, the pains and all that, you, you're you not comfortable here. You know what? Just come into the room and sleep with me. Oh, sorry. What? I mean, sleep on the bed with me. On your bed? Um, no, I'm, I'm fine. Eric, don't say no. Please, this is coming from a place of concern. Victor was my boyfriend. We were together for a year and three months. Wow. What a time. Yeah. He was... He wasn't a good human. I mean, he wasn't such a nice person. We had a lot of fights and separations within the 15 months we were together and each time he would leave come back and beg and when i accept him he would do the worst like we were separated for like five times in a 15 months relationship i'll say you were weak i saw you as um 
a walkover kind of person. But not to worry. I'm here now. Nobody's going to take you away from me. I'm going to protect you. Thank you, baby. Because I've not been so lucky with me. I guess God has finally blessed me with, with my own. Yes. He has sent me to you. <laughs> Sound very worried over the phone. What is it that you want to tell? Uncle, it's about the job. Oh, I'm a good sir. You have the job. The one that runs the company is a friend of mine. And I've spoken to him about you. And he gave me his word. So why not go and relax? Thank you. Thank you, Uncle. I... Hmm. Your late father was my bosom friend. And you are like a daughter to me. I will do anything for you. Let me tell you one thing. I promise your late father that I'll be there for him when the family needs him if he's gone. So whatever I do for you, I do it with the understanding about the relationship, very amazing relationship I had with your late father. Look, so please see that that. Thank you very much, Uncle. I truly appreciate. But what I am trying to say is, I, I want you to give the slot to someone else. He, he came for the interview too. I want you to give him the job. I believe you are not serious, or are you? I I am very serious, Uncle. The person in question is my man. And um, if God pleases, if everything works out fine, we are planning to get married. Lisa. Yes, Uncle. People came from far and wide for this job you are asking me to give to someone else. I know, Uncle. Since I really need you to help him. I... He's a very hard-working man. Giving him this job is like giving me the job. Besides, we're in love with each other. And he's someone you would really, really want to help if you meet him. Lisa, I've heard you. But I want you to do me just one little favor. I'm giving you two days from today. Go home and think about what you've just said and reverse back to me. Uncle, well, there's actually nothing to think about because I've thought about it thoroughly before I came here. I am certain, I am sure this is what I want. Please. Hmm. Well, Lisa, I will not do anything to hurt your feeling. But I want you to do this last favor for me. It's a must. I would like to see the young man in question. That is not a problem. As a matter of fact, I would come with him this weekend to see you. I am waiting. Thank you. Thank you so much. Of course, I told you there is no way my uncle is saying it to me. Though, at first, he was skeptical about it. But then again, he couldn't say no to his favorite niece. So what you're saying right now, in essence, is I automatically have a job now. Well, as long as there is tomorrow, it is sure as it is. So in <laughs> essence, wait for the good news. <laughs> you have a job. <laughs> mm. Thank you so much for all you do. Uh, it's nothing. I'm mm. so happy for you. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I can't wait to start this job and um, start earning. Do a lot of things for myself. Um, that is not all. There is more. My uncle has been so curious about this man who has got his niece going crazy. 
<laughs> so he wants to meet us this weekend. I mean, you. More especially. This weekend? Yes. He wants us to come to his house this weekend. Ah. I was hoping I'll get more time at least to, you know, change my wardrobe, get some nice stuff, look good before I meet him. Baby, I don't know why you're worrying about this. Come on, my uncle is a very simple man. He doesn't even care about all this, I mean, your look or something. He's just interested in what is here. Mm -hmm. All the same, I, I, I can't meet your uncle uh, looking like a tout. First impression. Okay, fine. I get it. I get it. So how about we go for shopping so we can change your wardrobe? And that way, trust me, by the time we are done, you will be more confident in who you are. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yes, I... I made something nice for you, something you love, actually, from my mother's recipe. Hold on, you're talking about food? Oh, yes. Food. You cooked? Of course I did. <laughs> <laughs> what did you cook? Don't worry, you get to see what I made when you're done having your shower. Come on, baby, you're getting me more curious. What did you make? Just go inside, have a cool bath, come back, and I'll serve you lunch <laughs> <laughs> i can't wait you know what let me run along let me go shower and come back <sighs> how are you how are you my husband told me about your decision to give that job opportunity to your boyfriend you think it's a wise decision Knowing fully well that both of you are not yet married. Until hopefully soon we will. I believe so. Oh, has he proposed yet? Not yet. But we love each other so much and I know he will do it soon. Listen to yourself. He has not proposed yet. Eh? And Eric is different. Truly. I know him very well, and I know that soon he will do the right thing. But trust me, you don't know him like I do. Oh my God. I just want to believe that you're not making the greatest mistake of your life. Just be careful. Men can do all things. Watch it. Listen, Lisa. There's nothing wrong in loving someone. You just have to carry your head and your hands along. Lisa, nothing is guaranteed. You just have to watch it. Do you understand? Yes, Auntie, I do. Thank you very much, Auntie. Oh Let me go and watch what's on the fire. Huh? Just be careful, yeah? Yes, Auntie. Thank you very much. I believe by now you don't have much appearance. She's just like a daughter to me. And the very day you hurt her, you hurt me. I will never hurt her, Uncle. I will love and cherish her forever. Are you aware of her decision to give you that golden opportunity? Yes, Uncle, I'm aware. Although I'm not pleased with her decision, but I do not have rights to change it. I am also aware that the job is actually her dream job. Good. That decision was a very mad one. If I will have my way, I will never do that. But I know her very well. I will do that. On one condition. And the condition is this. Any day I hear any complaints from her, that very day I will fight you. Not only that I will fight you, I will make sure you lose everything. It won't get to that, Uncle. I promise you. Thank you. 
supposed to be a cutting person. My uncle can be very funny sometimes. But he's a nice man though. Mm -hmm. A man is not nice one. Hmm? It's not nice at all. He 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 threatened me in there. Come on. We're, we're not even married yet and I I feel like I'm under threat. Are you serious? Yes! You need to find a way to make him respect me. Seriously, I'm, I am sorry if that is how you feel. I'm sorry. I, I'm sure he didn't intend to make you feel that way. Hmm? I am sorry now. I've said I'm sorry and you're keeping quiet. Let's go now. Why, why? I hope it satisfied you while I was gone. Excuse you. Hold on a minute. So you missed him so much. As soon as I left, you went to bring him into this house to sleep with him. The same house. I beg your pardon, Eric. What are you talking about? I'm not going to stand here and defend myself over baseless accusation because baseless. I don't know. Yes, I don't know what you're talking about. You Let's call it baseless. Of course it is. Very much for accommodating me, but I have to leave now. I cannot stay with a woman who does not love me or value me. I can't. I'm out. I'm what leaving. are you talking about? Of course, you know I value this relationship. And I love you so much. You know it. You slept with your ex under the same roof. Hey, what are you Stop denying it? I'm deny what? Because it didn't happen. I don't even know what you're talking about. This this is insane. Where did you get this idea from? You so lying. Eric, I am not lying. I'm done. Eric, come on, stop. This is wrong. Do you know I can never do a thing like that? I love you. And it's you I love. I was actually looking for a better way to share this good news with you. Good news? Mm -hmm. Hold on. Let me guess. You got the job. I was with your uncle when I, I got the mail. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Are you uh, serious? Yeah. Oh. Congratulations. Thank you Congrats. very much. Thank you. Thank you. <sighs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, baby. Mm -hmm. Were you really going to leave me? Nope. <sighs> it was actually a joke or prank. Sounds a that was an expensive joke. I'm sorry. You scared me. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. About your new job. Mm -hmm. Let's celebrate it. How? Mm. Another round. <laughs> 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 Joe, come on. I love him. Besides, my uncle will find me another job. I am not worried.
Please, my relationship with yours is different. It's not the same. My relationship is different. Uh, um, Angel, please can I call you back? My auntie is on the on the phone. Yeah, she's calling me. I'll call you right back. Okay, then. Hello, auntie. Good evening. What? When? No amount of tears will bring him back. Please. Yeah, Azu. Please. You don't understand. My husband is a very nice man. He took you. Yeah. We replace Azu for me. We take care of me the way Azu used to take care of me. He's a loving husband. I can't believe that Azu is no more. I cannot. Ah, I can't stand to it. Hey, my own is finished. It's what will I do? My lovely husband. Oh, it's okay. Oh. Stop crying, Biko. Stop. I'm so sorry. Stop. stop crying. You don't need this tears now. Don't have to stop crying. Let her cry. Okay, to ease herself, let her cry. She just lost a loved one. How can she stop crying? I don't want her to fall sick. She's not going to fall sick. She just ease herself. Oh, I'm all alone. Oh, no. My own is finished. It's not, My own is finished. It's not finished. So much sugar and wake us up. I need to see us. I need to see us. Okay, okay. Babe, come on, you can't be like this. Huh? This is just for a while. I need to go put things in place for us so you can come over. But baby, you know I can come with you to Asaba. I have a friend who stays in Asaba. I can stay in her house while you try to put up something for us. No, no, come on, man. I can have you come over to Asaba and stay in a friend's house. Relax. I'll just go down there, fix things and fix a place for both of us and then you come over. Besides, I always come down here by the weekend. Okay? We will always see you. I'll miss you too. Alright? I'll miss you so much. Okay? I'm doing this for us. Okay? And our baby. Oh, baby. Mm -hmm. Are you? Yes, baby. I am pregnant. I found out yesterday night, so I wanted to tell you. I do. You know I love you, right? Yes, baby. And I love you too. I love you so much. Please. We can't have a baby now. I want you to lose this child. Okay? Please. Listen. We don't have what it takes to cater for a child right now. Okay? Just, um, just remove the child, please. Eric, are you telling me to abort this child? Babe, we're going to have as many children as you want in the future. But now is not the time. I I know I just bagged a good paying job, yeah? But a child is not on our list. We have a whole lot to do. Please, do this for me. I bought the child. Okay? I 
Right. I am keeping the baby, Eric. Eric, how can you do this to me? So how, how can you say this to me after everything I did for you? After all we've been through, after all I had to sacrifice for you. Fine. Eric, listen. If not for anything, for the sake of this unborn child, the child is innocent. Please, I'm, I'm begging you. Eric, are you the one saying this to me? Eric, are you the one saying this to me after everything I did for you, Eric? Eric, that you have a job today is because of me. I gave you my opportunity because that was supposed to be my job. That was supposed to be my opportunity. Eric, I gave you shelter when no one would, would take you in. When you were homeless. I fed you, I clothed you. I... Eric, except God is no longer God. Except there is no God in heaven, then you... the call of me. This... He ended the call on me. Eric, you're a bastard. You are an ingrate. I regret about meeting you in my life. I gave you everything, this kind of We are all we have now. And we can't give up at this point. I want you to always remember that mommy loves you so much. She loves you with everything in her and she will make sure that you are right. It's full of mysteries What goes around must come around Oh, oh Please call me. That's from the office. Eric, why are you lying? I'm not lying. It's from the office. So why are you not picking up if it's from the office? It's from the office. I just don't want to pick up. Eric. Okay, no problem. I have a list of things I want you to get for me. You know, I don't eat late night. So. It's alright. I'll do anything for you, okay? And my love. I'll do anything for you and my baby. You have to be here before 6 p.m. I will, okay? Oh, I know. okay. And baby. Eric, mm -hmm. you better not be lying to me. You better not be lying to me because you will not see me or this child again. Don't say that. You know you mean the word to me. I mean, you and the baby. Once our plans fall in place, We'll be together forever, I promise you. Hmm? Alright, I've got to leave. Uh, okay, I'll send you the list. Okay. Ah. Come here. Uh.
Stop going around breaking hearts. Stop playing games. Ooh. Cause you don't know what life was for you. Yeah. This life is full of mysteries. What goes around must come around. Hi! Bros, bros. You are about leaving. Oh yes, I have um I have a meeting to attend to. Okay. Yes. Alright. So I'll see you some other time. Hey, bros, now nah, anything for the boys. Bros, bros. You did fresh, you know. Bro, bro. Hey, what don't move. I want to go you. Hi. All right, sir. Bro. Hi. I saw you right now. So, what's up now? Nothing, everything is going as planned. Look, I'll be honest with you. I am actually losing my patience right now. Babes, it's not easy for me being under the sun, knowing fully whether another man is inside the house drilling my woman. Paul, we've had this conversation before. We are doing what we have to do to get what we want. I cannot stop having sex with him. He's going to have another woman. And that is not good for us. Uh, I understand. But you need to hasten things up. Okay? That's by the way. How much did they drop? Not enough. It's only when it comes from work. Which one is not enough when it comes from which work? So which one are they inside house they do since? Why are you raising your voice? I don't understand. How what do you much not understand? Did he did he not give, give me money. You? He did not give me money. He did not give you money. Yes. Look at you. I hope you're not falling in love with that man. Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. Which one is all the time that you both spent together? He did not give you any money. He did not give me money. Okay, fine. Look, call him. I need money. Wait until he comes from work. <sighs> Stop now. You're getting me pissed. I need money. <laughs> I gave you money yesterday, Paul. Last night, to be precise. How much do you need? I need 20,000 Naira. 20,000? I gave you 50 last night. What but did you do with it? I don't understand. Are you monitoring me? Yes, I am. Because it is me that is doing all the work. What are you doing with the money? <laughs> Look, I need 20,000 Naira. Please call him. I cannot call him. You're getting me pissed, babe. Okay. Babes. Babes, what? Why are you beating yourself so hard, Angel? Are you the first woman not to conceive in her husband's house? Look at you! How else am I supposed to feel? Is there any other, other way I'm supposed to feel? Let me know. I mean, my husband is having an affair. And that scares me. I'm really scared. Angel, tell me, what scares you? Excuse me. Don't tell me you were scared of your husband having children with his mistress or mistresses. What are you saying? Who would it be? Oh. No, I'm asking you. Who would it be? Well, you know what? You are not in my shoes, so I don't even expect you to understand. But on the contrary, I understand. I know how it hurts. But do you have a solution to this? No. Or do you want to kill yourself for not having children? The answer is no. You are not barren, Angel. The hospital report says you're fit. I don't know why you're putting yourself through all this. 
But you know I am not getting any more younger. If you keep acting this way, it is going to take you a very long time for you to conceive. All you need to do is relax. Relax and take your mind off this. Keep praying and God will answer your prayer. I don't know, if you keep acting this way, Angel, it's really going to be difficult. Of course you know it's very difficult. Man, I, I know exactly what I'm doing, right? I know. I'm the only child of my parents. It's all right. But I know the amount of pressure that's been mounted on me. You know what? It's your choice. It's your life. Oh, yes. why, why are you sounding like this, Nidu? You're, you're my friend, for God's sake. Huh? Exactly why I'm sitting here listening to you. This whole thing you're saying doesn't make sense to me at all. It doesn't make sense. I mean, you're burying yourself deep in the blue sea. That's what it looks like. Nidu, I have this under control. Okay? Regina is carrying my child. And so far, she has been so understanding. And Angel, your wife? She's just there. I need a child. All right. It's a child I want. I hope you're happy. Of course I'm happy. And thank you very much for the call. You saved my life. Uh, Regina just can't get enough of me. She wants me around her all the time. Hmm? Talk about Regina. She's calling. Uh, yeah, hello, baby. This fool is just pissing me off. So, like, is he sending the money, sir? Like, he has a choice. Of course he is. Oh, hey! Baby, baby. <laughs> so let me tell you, hey, look at you. This pregnancy looks so cute on you. See, I promise you, hey, if all our plans get executed, I will treat you and pamper you like a baby girl that you are. You trust me now. So what happens to pamper me and treat me like a baby girl now? You want me to... Hmm. Don't worry yourself. I will do the need for me. What am I using myself to do now? Nah. Don't break my bones. I'm done. I'm so small. small. Ah. What you use on here? You don't know your hands. Your hands are strong. Yeah. in my house. Where is she? Oh, <laughs> look at Lisa. Lisa, look at you. Come, 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 come. Uh -uh. What? Jesse, how are you? Come on, come on, come on. 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 I 
it's okay. There's no time to apportion blames. It's okay. It's obvious that that man never loved you. Else he would not allow you to to do those sacrifices knowing how much you needed that job. And besides, you were blinded by his love. That you didn't see through him. You didn't see who he truly was. You fell for it. But you know something? God will punish it because he's a beast for treating a, a, a good woman like this. Like this. Treating you like this, God will punish him. God will punish him. It's okay, Angel. And amen to your amen. prayer. Amen. <laughs> Which was why I had to move on with my life the moment he rejected the pregnancy. I had to pick up the pieces of my life and forge ahead. I'm sorry, what did you say? He rejected it, asked me to have an abortion. <laughs> Lisa, do you know I've been married for four years? I've never had a miscarriage. Took less off. Pregnancy and his reject this? Just why? Just, just tell me why a man would do that. Why? Angel. Here. Let me have your hand. It's okay. Listen. Don't go there. Don't. Listen to me. When the time is right, God will give you your own children. Do you understand? Just think it is okay. It's how you do not understand. I'm losing my marriage. My husband no longer pay attention to this marriage. He comes back home anytime he wants. But don't worry. You're here today, right? You'll see the time he'll return home. My husband is no longer my husband, Lisa. I'm losing my marriage. Angel. Angel, look at me. I need you to look at me. Why, sister, me? Stop worrying about things you have no control over. Just let it be. All you need to do is make sure you commit yourself and your family into the hands of God and watch Him take care of it for you because at the right time, everything will be alright. And if you're so desperate of having a child in this house, then adopt. Yes, but you have to do it with the consent of your husband. I don't know now. Because he does not want to hear of it. No. And he will never give me peace to conceive. So I do not know what to do. I don't know what to do. I'm losing it. This house is becoming so boring for me. You are working yourself up. Can't you see it? You are stressing yourself out that even if a baby gets into your tummy, how would this baby stay with this stress? Take it easy. Everything will be all right. Everything will be fine. Just trust God. Okay? I'm so happy you're here now. And I'm happy I'm here too. Please, you keep me company because this house is. It's boring. Yeah. Don't worry, and I am here. Just call me to a church rat. For information, every Friday night, I would not be here with you. I'm always going to church. So, you know. Mm. That's okay. I don't have a problem with that. <laughs> Just drink. I'm coming. I uh, might as well go with you. Of course I do. <laughs>
Welcome, sir. Thank you. Yes, sir. My wife didn't go to church today. Yes, sir. Why? Because she has a visitor, sir. A visitor? Yes, sir. All right. What are you doing here? No, I should be asking you what are you doing here? Where is my wife? Wife? Hold on. Are you Angel's husband? Listen, I do not know how you ended up here, but you need to leave now. <coughs> now. Hi, babes, you're back. Oh, um... Hi. Um, I heard voices. Did you come back with anybody? Um, I was only surprised to meet a stranger in our living room. My friend. Friend? Yes. Do you remember my childhood friend I told you about? We served to go in Taraba. Is it me? I told you about her. Is it me? Is it me? She's is um, <laughs> well, um, isn't it um, nice to finally meet you? Mm -hmm. I've heard a lot about you. Uh, I've equally heard a lot about you. I mean, it's so nice to finally put a face to the name. <laughs> nice to meet you, sir. <laughs> yeah. I'll be good. Isn't it? <laughs> Eric, Angel's husband. Just in the way of voice, she might be hearing. I you. don't care. Just send her out. Okay? I don't want a third party with us in this house. I am sorry, I cannot send her out. Please, she's pregnant, and the idiot that got her pregnant rejected the baby. Is that what she told That's you? That's what it is. What if she told you what she told you just to get your sympathy? Listen, Lisa is my friend, and I trust that she cannot lie. Alright, fine. You can always help her from a distance. All right, send her out. She has nowhere to go to. I don't care. Just send her out. I'm sorry, love. I, I, I cannot send her out. I can't turn my back on a friend that, that needs me right now. I can't. I'm sorry. I can't do that. Angel, you must send her out. Well, sweetie, I'm sorry. I cannot send her out. Lisa is my responsibility, and I'm here to help her. She's here to stay. This life is full of mysteries What goes around must come around Oh, oh, oh Oh, oh, oh Ooh. Ooh. Oh, oh Everything alright? Yes, why do you ask? Um, he, I mean your husband, doesn't seem to like me. Lisa, why would you say that? Why would you say that? Besides, this is my house. I invited you. So, 
That's why I need to talk it by me. So relax, feel at home, please. No, Angel, Angel, listen. I don't want to be the reason you and your husband get into any kind of conflict. Please. If it's not okay by him, I can go. I can actually go. It's, it's fine. Eric, we fight all the time. So it has nothing, absolutely nothing to do with you. So feel at home, relax. I don't know what your intentions are, but first thing tomorrow morning, you're out of this house. Very good. You are demonic. You didn't even bother to ask me about your child. Or who do you think owns this pregnancy? Listen, stop looking for me. Stop following me. Excuse you. Stop. Stop. I am not following you. I didn't know this was your house. I said, stop. No, you stop being wicked. Is everything okay? Uh, uh, everything is fine. I just bumped into your husband, so we're just talking about life. That's okay. Yeah. Uh, Dinner is ready. Oh, just come, 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 come. Thank you. Where do you think you're going? Go to your Go around. Where are they? You play with my heart. You play with my feelings. You play with my soul. Which kind of man be this? My wife is on this side. Where dinner is on the other side with my baby. And somehow, Lisa comes into the picture. Three women. Three women. My wife and Lisa, my pregnant girlfriend, are under the same roof as we speak right now. Huh? Come in. Sir, this is from the head office. Uh, uh, did they tell you the content of this letter? I'm sorry, sir. This is a letter for you. All departments have been sent a letter to this effect. And also, the new HR will be resuming on Monday. I'm sorry, sir. Uh, thank you. I swear that girl Lisa is full of bad luck. She's full of bad luck. This is because of her. I'm certain it's because of her. You can't say that, Eric. Eric, you can't say that. You and I knew a day like this would come. Somehow you've been performing below expectation. Well, why, why would you say anything like that? No, why? Now tell me, why would a thing like this happen now that she's here? It's obvious she's full of bad luck. Don't you get it? Eric, just calm down, okay? Relax. Calm down, okay? Just calm down. Why is your wife's office like that? I just lost my job. What did you say? I did not hear you. I just lost my job. Ha! You cannot lose your job, who? God forbid, though. You lost your job, how? What did you do? Why? You cannot lose your job, who? So how am I supposed to survive with this child? What is going to happen to the unborn baby now? You don't have to worry about that. So done. I'll make sure you and the baby don't lack anything. Thank you. Me, I haven't wanted to tell you. Me, I'm tired of staying in this room, Apollo. I cannot be staying here. This place is very uncomfortable. It's very tight. It's not good for the child. 
And every time you come, my brother will go outside for you and I to have a private time. It's no good. It's no. I was actually thinking about that before this ugly incident. But don't worry, I'll um, I'll see what I can do before you put to bed. Okay? Put to bed? Ha! No, I'm talking now. I cannot stay here one more night too. I can't. All my body is doing is. I'm talking now, now, now. You are talking. Put to bed. Put to bed is how many months from now? No. It's all right. I'll, I'll, uh, I'll call the agent to look for a three-bedroom apartment. I'm, I'm sure that will be enough for you and the baby. Three bedroom. Yeah. What am I supposed to do with three bedroom? At least it's big enough. For who? For you and the baby. Ha! What's the difference between three bedroom and this room, Apollo? No, me, I don't want three bedroom, please. I want a duplex. What am I doing with a three bedroom apartment? I want a duplex. It's alright, I'll do um, I'll see what I can do. Is that a yes? Yes? He told you about it. He lost his job. Oh he lost his job. Gosh. This is so bad. Very bad. I'm sure he feels so terrible about it. But we need to find a, another way out than crying over a spilled milk. Well, Angel, it's okay. I mean, who are we to question God and things He allowed to happen in our lives? We just have to give Him thanks. Like He, like he said, give thanks in any situation. So everything will be alright. Thank you. That's none of your business. Besides, one door closes, a better and bigger door opens. You think so? Of course I know so. Well, not in this case, my darling. Because this is karma. Karma paid you a visit for all the evil you have done. And guess what? This is just the beginning. Heart of a man is wicked, heart of a man is evil, heart of a man is sinful, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I gave you my heart, I gave you my soul, I gave you everything, this kind of love, this kind of love. You play with my heart, you play with my feelings. You play with my soul, which kind man be this? Onye mazi madu ne bunu madu le Onye bonye mm ne me mi fe ne me Onye ne me mm na fu monu no nya Oh love, why? Oh, what a love Love sometimes frustrate you Love sometimes betray you Oh yeah my best friend, but friend of me. Oh, yeah. Why you do me so? Oh, 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 why, why? You play with my heart. You play with my feelings. You play with my soul. Which kind man be this? Yeah, yeah. Onye mazi madu ne bunu madule. 
Onye bonye m, ne me mi fe ne me m Onye ne me m, na fu monu no nya O love you, why? He knows when to play the game He knows how to play the game He hits at the right button He's the master Excuse me, my dad Oh, okay Yes, sir You miss me, right? Oh, yes. I know you miss me. You and I have got some type of energy. Very strong energy. Say it. You must be out of your mind if you think I care about you, Eric. If I were you, I'll be bothered about my wife, not me. I know you're angry. Oh, shit. I know you're sad. I know you're mad at me. Can you just shut up? You want to pick up this fuck right now? Please sit in my eyes. But come on. I can make all that pain go away with just one touch. One strong touch. I'm sure you know you what I mean. You're sick. <laughs> you need help. You're sick. <laughs> <sighs> Sorry, sorry about that. That was my dad. I'll do it. Okay, sir. Excuse me. What? Already? What happened? No, no problem. No, no, no. I, uh, I kind of lost my appetite. Why? I, I think it's the baby. Listen, any, anything you want to eat is in the kitchen. Please make yourself comfortable. Okay, of course, I know this is my house, like you always say. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Uh, you take it easy. Okay, okay. Yeah. okay thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Dad sent his regards. You know, I have really been thinking now that you've lost your job, what's next? I do not want to work for anybody again. I want to start up my own business. Yeah. Hmm. That sounds nice. So, um, do you have any business idea? Any? Well, I'm still working on it. But top of my list is... Um, Transportation business. Okay. Listen, honey, I need you to think about this. Think through. Yeah. Well, please. Yeah, I will. <laughs> so, how much do you have in your account? Oh, um, I, I recently did some online investment mm -hmm. yes right now i do not have any cash in my account oh, hold on okay now what did you say you don't have any money 
I did an online investment. Yes, I just invested all my money. See, hold on, because I foot all the bills in this house. I do everything in this house. Now I need to ask you, what do you do with your salary? Investment. Investment. I put in to get some more. Yeah, it's obvious. You've been investing on women. So disappointed at you. Is there anything you need to tell me about the guilt on your face? What nonsense are you talking about? What nonsense guilt is that? Huh? Or you're just looking for a problem where there's none? Hey, listen to me. Any day that I will catch you red-handed, you, any day that I will catch you red-handed, that will be it. Catch me doing what exactly? Huh? I think I know your problem. Your idol. That's why you go around the house looking for where to make troubles. What did you call me? Idol. You called me idol. Oh yes, that's what you are. Every you called me idol. Of course you are. Idol. Don't forget where I picked you up from. Don't forget that I made you. You call me idol, me. You. Into a pretty thing. It's okay, Daphne. It's okay. No, it's not okay. It's okay. Listen. I picked him up from the gutter. It's okay. Listen, I don't know what this is all about. But whatever it is, I believe you two can sort it out. Okay, just... I made him. I made him who he is. You stand here before me to call me idol? Excuse me, Listen to me. Listen. Listen to me. You have to stop working yourself up. Darling, you're working yourself up for nothing. Please, just, just, just take it easy. So I, I am. I'm tired of this marriage. I am. I am tired. What have I done for this man? What? He's doing everything to keep frustrating me in this house. He is frustrating me, and I'm tired. I, I cannot take it anymore. I, 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 I am the president. Do you realize you are hurting yourself by what you're doing? You need to start focusing on yourself. Just let him be. Because I believe one day he will wake up and see the good-hearted woman he has by his side. And then he will make amends. Okay? Listen. You know I can't deceive you. I am telling you this from experience. Babes, you know my story. You know what I've been through. Huh? You need to focus on you. Focus on yourself. It's not for anything, for your mental health. For the sake of your mental health. Oh my god. Thank you. Thank you. Babe, see, the time we are in right now is what they call injury time. Okay? If we hit this jackpot, we will both relocate to Ghana and start our lives there. And if we fail, that means all our effort is in vain. And you know what that means? I am handling it. No, you are not handling anything. You know you've been handling things all this while and nothing is working. Do you understand? So this time around, I am in charge. So what are you saying? Good. She is coming, Abi. Mm -hmm. Good. And when he gets here, he wants to touch you. I mean, make love to you. That's normal. Good. Now. You will not allow him to touch you. 
No, that's too harsh. We'll be pushing him to his wife's arms. I wouldn't want that. Babes, like we said earlier, I am in charge. Just listen to me. See, when he comes here and he wants to touch you, refuse. I know men and I know how all of this works. Okay? See, if he wants to make love to you, tell him no, you won't be making love to him in this one room and your, your brother is in the living room. If he wants you and he wants to keep knocking and enjoying you the way he does, he should get to a bigger place like a two place. I think that's him. Yes. The ball is on. Go! I said you should relax, okay? I'll do something about it. I just lost my job. What do you want me to do? Climb until when, Eric? Until when? Is this when my brother dragged my nakedness outside? You will know this matter is serious. Huh? He, he almost walked in on me yesterday naked. I cannot even lie down freely in my house because I don't know where my brother will walk into this place. Yes, this place is too tight. Okay, so you should see my body. You don't know it's a taboo where I come from. Something can happen to me or this child. Do you want to kill me? God forbid. Nothing will happen to my child. That will happen if you don't do something. Something will happen. You cannot afford it. You can afford it. It's alright. Um, I'll see what I can do about it. Alright? When? I'll, I'll, I'll get an agent and um, ask him to look for a nice duplex for you and the baby. Don't worry. Hmm? Paul actually has a friend as an agent. So I'll just talk to Paul and Paul talk to the agent. I'll find something. Alright, tell Paul to tell the agent to, you know, hasten up. Mm. Find one ASAP so Thank you. settle for it. You're the best. Thank you. Thank you. As soon as we have this house, I will um, I'll move you with you and the baby. <laughs> oh, okay. Thank you. Okay. So that's why you were acting like this. I'm sorry. Okay. Stop going around breaking hearts. Stop playing games. Ooh. Cause you don't know what life was for you. Nedu. Yes. Your friend is now a total stranger in his own home. I'm sure you know he has he has lost his job with his company. What? Lady, we've been married for so many years. With no child. What's your friend does he doesn't care. He doesn't want to know, he doesn't show any concern. And I mean, we are not getting any younger, you know. We are not. So I... Oh, hi. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. You're um, welcome. Thank you. Need to meet my friend Lisa from Indigo. Oh, you are the Lisa? I mean, my friend have told me so much about you. Thank you very much. Um, Lisa will be here with us until she goes to bed. Lisa? Mm -hmm. Me is my husband's best friend. I was just telling him about his friend. Once again, you're, you're welcome. And I believe now that you're here, I can plead with you. Please. Can you help us talk to your friend? Please. Let's, let's try and find a solution to this constant conflict between him and his wife because marriage is not supposed to be a war front it's actually supposed to be a place of peace between two lovers two allies two two partners two two two, two, two like minds and not a constant place of war um, well i will try my best Eric is a very difficult person. I'm sure both of you know by now. 
but I will try my best. Thank you very much. And you're welcome, you're welcome. Let me give you two too. Okay. Thank you, Lisa. Bye bye. What's the problem? Why are you why are you looking sad? Excuse me. Because you're the one stay here, babe. I don't blame you. You don't know how awful it is sleeping over on the chair. But so we've gone through this thing now. This thing is as if I'm doing it for myself. Am I not doing it for you? So of you to show appreciation. Paul. Stop there. Go back to your room. Ugu will kill you there. Say, go back to your room. Udo! Okay. My friend, will you come and open the gates? What's the problem? Eric, go back to where you are coming from. Go back. Please, go and sleep there. Don't you know it's dangerous out here? Oh, really? You have decided to die already by the way of life you've chosen. So go back. You have my permission. Go back to where you're coming from, Eric. Go back. Angel. Babe, open the gates. You have to take this easy. Come on. You're going about this the wrong way. I mean, two wrongs doesn't make it right. What if anything happens to him out there? What if he gets kidnapped or robbed or something? How do you think he will feel? Can you open the gate? Oh, no, and who cares if anything happens to him? Who cares? I don't care. Angel, you care. Udo! Madam, give me the gate keys. Udo! Yeah? Udo! Yeah? Come and open this gate now. Stop going around freaking hearts. Stop playing games. Cause you don't know what life was for you yeah. This life is full of mysteries What goes around must come around Oh, oh Don't you hear me? I said my wife locked me out. Eh? So what do you want me to do? Should I go and fight her? Or you want me to go and meet her and force her to open the door for you? I don't understand. Are you not here already? Let's go inside and go and shower. You sleep. Ha! Your wife locked you out, okay? Let's go. Let's go now. Stop going around freaking hard. Stop playing games Ooh, Cause you don't know what life was for you yeah. My love Everything that's been happening has been the work of the devil I want to turn a new leaf for you I want to be a better husband Give me a chance a second chance to do this. I'm sorry. You know, all I just wanted is just a peaceful home. A peaceful home that's all I asked for. Well, I have forgiven you. Since you've promised to turn a new, new leaf and give me my peace of mind. I... And I promise with everything 
that I've got and everything that I am to be a better man treat my wife rightly and I also promise to be the, the best wife and to help you in any way that I can <laughs> my darling wife my baby. Yes, Sonny. My sugar. <laughs> <laughs> my everything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, um, my friend. Uh, the one who wants to teach me palm oil exportation. We're supposed to have a meeting today. You mean you are... You are going for a meeting now? Oh yes, I should go for a meeting now. Okay, can I go with you so I can be able to hear everything myself? Of course, yes, you can, but today is our first meeting, alright? I need to go alone, maybe some other time. Hmm? Okay, babe, you need to promise me that you, you will not take any decision. You have to think about everything before deciding. Please, I'm begging you. I promise you. I'll think everything through before deciding. All right? All right let me go get ready. All right. Hmm? It's All right. okay. Yes. You can use my car if you want your car. <laughs> Hey, please hurry up so you won't be late. I was not a talk, see, get one house, one seat. That has now 12 million naira been a project with it. The sweet of prayer about the house, say, the place to make sense. The whole bedroom, jacuzzi, dam, the whole room now, POP, the compound get swimming pool. Can you see this place? 24 hours power supply, light day 247. You get another hour get ready for government outside, for hospital road, that one has 7 million naira. You clean. The other two now 6.5. That one has 6.5. You need. The good thing about the home at Abisei, the landlord will get the houses. Don't die. They know that life. And how is that a good thing if the landlord is dead? You don't know. Fast about here. Any house where you won't find, so far say the landlord will that life, maybe the best thing will happen to you. Those people shall be worried. Mm. Yes, now. Nah. Anyways, babe, what do you think? Oh, I like that one of 12 million. Mm -hmm. 12 million? Yeah, it sounds really good. Huh. 12 million. I cannot afford it though. Agent. Come on. Um, please. Let's go for the one of 7 million. Uh, the one of seven million makes sense. Uh, in it, see? Yes, I've been there. I expected it is a nice place. Oh no, no, in it. All right. Uh, you give me your number so we can keep in touch, okay. and then I'll let you know when I'm ready. To... Oh no, babe, that, that's that's not important. Okay, he's Paul's friend, so anytime we we are ready, we will just talk to Paul, mm -hmm. and Paul will take us to him. That was I make sense pass. Paul and my guy, and my correct guy. Anytime we need the house. You go just call me. I think call me. I don't know. I'm going to show you the place. You go like her. Okay. I'm going to move you. Oh, what's in your phone? All right, now. Yeah, I don't know what that's every day. I want to check for you. You know, I just lost my job. How am I supposed to pay you up me right now? Where will I get the money from? Am I, am I buying the, the, the land? Am I, am I paying for that? Anyways, how soon are we looking at it? Very soon. What was it? Thank you. Hey, see what they. Your 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 blessing and your talent now just they do Nollywood movie. You they finish war guy. I want to ask you a question. I hope Sanu go in that trouble. You relax. Who's not going in that trouble? You don't believe my matter. Eh? Mm. See do I just tell you? Guy, you off your. 
see, the most important thing is that my wife just won't be kidding you. I don't want trouble. If this is going to put me to trouble, I beg next time, no call me. Now, I relax. Don't put me for trouble. Anytime you just call me. Relax, see. Your wife just put to bed. Now, my, my, my press, my press, but may you feel up. Too fast, man. Calm down, not see the apple. Don't say complete. Can't I nah. can't I don't trust you. You don't believe me now, Abi. Anyway, uh, complete shot. Thank you. See, 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 see. Any time we be saying any kind of deal like this, fallout. I'll vote you, bro. I can tell you all my life. I never do this kind of shit. Sharp, sharp busy. Don't count money. Give me a bit. Next time, call me. Yes, but don't go put me for trouble. No, call me. I'm up for there, John. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like this, now they go house now. No, come go do one, one, bro. You understand? Move go by, you know that. So what's the most important man? No, yeah, yeah, yeah. You be cool. She's coming. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Um, you're welcome. Uh, meanwhile, do I offer you anything? I mean, while you wait for her? No, it's fine. I'm good. You're sure you're good? Sure, I'm good. Water. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome once again. Thank you. Miku! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, you're welcome. Thank you. So, how was your trip? Oh, no regrets. <laughs> so, what's up? Nothing much. Everything is okay. Um, <laughs> Sorry, I have to excuse myself. Hello, Lisa. Let me let you two catch up. Lisa, please meet my friend Zainab. Zainab, my childhood friend, now turned sister. Isn't she the one you told me that stays in any? Lisa, yes, she's the one. Oh my goodness! <laughs> nice to meet you, Zainab. Same here. Nice meeting you. You're welcome. <laughs> And let me leave you two ladies to chit chat. Mm -hmm. I don't, you have a lot to catch up on. Oh, okay. No worries. Well, once again, you're welcome. Eh? Thank you. Feel, in case you need anything, just let me know. Okay? Okay. Thank you. <laughs> so, how are you? What? Angela, are you sure about this? Sure about what? Keeping a grown up woman in your house, considering the kind of husband you have. <sighs> Zena. No man would want to sleep with a pregnant woman. Listen, I know Eric is bad, but he cannot sleep with a pregnant woman. Angel, men of nowadays will sleep with anything. They even go as far as sleeping with mad women. What do we talk about women? They sleep with anything just to get their own comfort. Anyways, let's leave that topic for another day. How long do you intend on keeping her? Well, immediately she put to bed, she can... Look for another job and also look for an accommodation, maybe here in Asaba. Angel. What? Shine your eyes, oh. What? <laughs> Meanwhile, ah, where is Eric? And how is he coping with the loss of his job? <sighs> well, he's fine. He's trying to go into Pamoyel exploitation. So he has gone to see his friend that is into it. So it's fine. It's all right. I just hope he learns his lesson Would this you time. Stop? Stop. <laughs> so, what can I bring for you, please? I think we should go get it together. Oh, well, you're used to the hustle. <laughs> of course, it's your hustle. You <laughs> stop going around breaking hearts. Stop playing games. Ooh. Cause you don't know what life was for you. Yeah. This life is full of mysteries What goes around must come around Oh, oh, oh Oh, oh, oh Ooh. 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 Oh, oh, oh Oh, oh, oh Stop going around breaking hearts Stop playing games Ooh. Cause you don't know what life was for you 
FPA. This life is full of mysteries. What goes around must come around. Oh, 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 It's alright. I like it. Yeah, I know you like it. It's really nice. Yes. So you tell me the place though, Kabi. You like her. Chamo! Let me see if you like her. We'll take this one, okay? <laughs> You're the best, thank you. <laughs> okay. Let's go, babe. Hey, Chamo. So, um, that man they just left. Which man? Do, do you know him? Ah, uh, that was my wife. Husband and wife? What's up? No, 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 I'm sorry. I thought he was someone I know. I'm so sorry. Ha! That chairman of you know you. A big guy be that. Oh, no! Us to talk. Talk. Hmm? Uh. Stop. What's going on? I want settlement. Yes, Eric. I can't continue to do this with you and your wife under the same roof. It's becoming dangerous. So I need you to give me a house and a reasonable amount of money so I can get going. Nobody's asking me to leave. Besides, you know I just lost my job. Erika, I have never been in, in your budget. I have never been in the picture for you. So the earlier you let me and my baby walk away, the better for you. Angel is not a fool. Because sooner than later, she's going to find out. And trust me, I am not ready to jeopardize my relationship with her. So you need to do the needful. All right. Um, I'll think about it. Hmm? Just stop. This, this is you. Stop. This, this is you.
Onye mazi madu ne bulu madu le Onye bonye mm ne mem ife ne mem Onye ne mem na fumonu nonya O love why This was the devil's handbook. I, I, I don't know what got into me, but I'm sorry. Okay? I, I'm, I'm truly sorry. Listen, Angel, I'm ready to do whatever you want. I will pay you all your money in full. I promise. Angel. Baby, I'm sorry. I'm truly sorry. And I, I, I know you're angry. I, I know you're sad. But, but, but please, I, I'm, I'm so sorry. Please come in, please. Yeah, come in. Yes. Officers. Yes, ma'am. That's the man taking him out. Baby, it has no cotton to this. Move him. Okay. Gentlemen, stand up! Huh? Stand up! Okay. Move! Baby. Baby. Move! Move! Baby, now, please. Baby, don't... No, take time, my friend. Now. Move. You play with my heart, you play with my feelings, you play with my soul, which kind man be this? Oh my god! We, we made it! Freedom at last! Go. Oh my goodness! We are seven million naira richer! Ah. Come on! Just take it easy! <laughs> Big congratulations to us, babe! Oh my goodness, I'm so... Oh my god! Oh, I cannot wait to settle down. We're when are we leaving? When are we leaving? Now, oh, now, no, babe, we're going to Ghana. First thing tomorrow morning. Right? I'll be preparing our paperwork to travel first thing tomorrow morning. <laughs> oh, I need to call my cousin. Sorry. Yes. I need to call my cousin to start looking for an apartment, small house for us. Okay. So when we get to Ghana, we'll just move in. Oh my God, this is such an amazing no. plan. I am so excited. I cannot wait. I am tired of that man. That man was so annoying. I swear. Oh my goodness! Yeah. Oh. I jumped too much. My waist is paining me. <laughs> yes, Alpha. No, no, no. Calm down, calm down. I will give you the gist later. See, but see, I am disappointed in you. I warned you. I warned you. I didn't know you get to this. Look at me now. Hmm? The problem with smart people like you is that they think others are fools. That woman, Angel, loves you so much. And she was willing to do everything for you. I mean anything for you. If only she would give me another chance to make things better. I just need one more chance. So, where is the money now? If we can retrieve that 7 million naira, you will get out of here. Where can we find the money? It's in Regina's account. Uh, we're supposed to pay for a house today. You can go and get it from her. Just, just tell her I need, and, and I need the money urgently. So, where does she stay? Where? Number 7 Crescent Avenue. This is so unfortunate. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Please, that lady that lives at the first floor, where is she? Is she around? Sister Regina. Yes, Regina. No, she she don't travel with her boyfriend this morning. No, 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 no. Her boyfriend sent me to her. You understand? Her boyfriend sent me to her. Eric. Eric is my friend now. Oh, guy Eric. Yes. No, no, our guy Eric now sponsor now. That's what she used to say. Our guy Eric now sponsor. Where they always call me a conscious love now. Hold on. You mean? Eric is not the boyfriend. Yes, now Paul and I be the boyfriend and she and her boyfriend don't travel Paul. Maybe the father to the picking where she they carry. Okay, no, no problem. No problem. No problem. Angel, can you stop feeling defeated? You are the winner here. They all lost you. 
Why didn't I notice? <laughs> Why? Those two were having an affair under my nose. I didn't even know. They fooled me. Both of them fooled me. No. They fooled themselves, rather. You know, I have never been in support of a grown-up woman living on the same roof with you. Because I know Eric is a he goat. How would I know? <sighs> when did I notice? And I was even going to introduce her to my good business when she puts to bed. And this is it. Listen to this to me. <laughs> Life. It's okay. <sighs> you just have to put yourself together. Please. <laughs> Please put yourself together. Really? The deed has been done. There's nothing you can do about it. So just put yourself together, please. Oh, where, where, did I, where did I go from? Afana, what's up? It looks like you're going to stay a little longer. What are you saying? How? She absconded with the money. No, that's not possible now. She's carrying my child. She absconded to Ghana with the money and her lover, Paul. Ah. Yes. You have the information all wrong. Paul is her brother. Her blood brother. <laughs> that was what they made you to believe. They have been fooling you all this while. Yes, her neighbor told me the truth. She said you were her sponsor. That was what she told her. Yes. And also, you are not the father of the baby. The baby belongs to Paul. Hey! Man, I'm so sorry. The money is gone. The money is not my problem now. Bro, I, I, I think you, you need to help me keep an eye on Lisa. She's the only one carrying my real child right now. Please, I'll, I'll give you her number so you, you, you call her and, and... I need to get out of here, man. Oh, I am confused right now, Eric. The only option you have left now is Angel. She's the only one that can help you out of this now. All right, can you help me, Richard? Tell her I'm ready to, to sign an agreement, an undertaking. Uh, I'll, I'll pay off the money. Please, I need to get out of here. Okay. Thank you, man. Thank you so much. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. He is still your husband. Hey, dude, that man is a sinful man. He can never change. Give him a second chance, please. Really? Everyone deserves a second chance. Really? So what are you saying? Do I deserve what he did to me? Do I deserve it? That man did me dirty. He did me dirty and you're asking me to give him another chance? Oh no, I do not have another chance to give. I am done. At least, get him out of detention. I know what he did to you was unfair, but please have mercy on him. Please, that guy is in a very bad condition right now. Yes, I know. He has been unfair to you. Please. Heart of a man is wicked. Heart of a man is evil. Heart of a man is sinful. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I gave you my heart. I gave you my soul. I gave you everything. This kind of love. This kind of love. You play with my heart, you play with my feelings, you play with my soul, which kind man be this? Onye mazi madu ne bulu madu le, onye bonye m ne me mi fe ne me m, onye ne me m na fumo nu nanya, o love why? Oh what a love, love sometimes frustrate you, love sometimes betray you. Oh yeah, oh yeah. My best friend, but friend of me. Why you do me so? Oh, 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 
why, why? You play with my heart, you play with my feelings, you play with my soul, which kind of man be this? On your mazi madu ne bulu madu le, on your boy ne me mi fe ne me, on your ne me na fu mo nu no nya, oh love why? You got so comfortable in your own game. One thing you must know is that you cannot eat your cake and have it. I had the opportunity of hearing Lisa's part of the story. And I was shattered. Hearing what you did to her. I mean, it's unfair. It's unfair. I was naive. I don't think you were. You took advantage of her love for you. Can you imagine what the poor girl had to go through? Because of the love she had for you. You really need to beg for her forgiveness. Do you think this is karma? Whatever you think this is, those women have nothing for you except unconditional love, true love for you. But you failed them. You really need to beg for their forgiveness. You really need to beg for their forgiveness. You no try at all. You really went too far. You sinned. Eric, you sinned. What's the problem? Why did you hit me? Why did you... You should get out of this house. Get out! I, I'm tired of this nonsense. You, you, you just brought bad luck into my life and now you're disturbing my... You, you, you're not even let me rest. Get out! Eric, you can't be talking to me like that. You have no right to talk to me like that. Not after ruining my life. Are you stupid? Besides, if you don't want me in this house, why did you send Nedu to bring me? You're very stupid for saying that nonsense. No, look at me. Take a look at me and then tell me who ruined who's life. What is it? What is it? Eric hates me. For no reason. What? Bro, tell this girl to get out of this house. Tell her to get out of this baby. She has ruined my life enough. I'm tired. Guy, what's your problem? What is your problem, Eric? As long as I am concerned, you are the one that ruined this girl's life. God bless you. Yes, you are the one. She has a baby for you, which Angel couldn't even give to you, even with her own money. How many times will I tell you this, Eric? Eh? For the sake of your baby. For the sake of your baby, Eric. Allow this woman to stay with you. I mean, this is the same woman, the same lady you loved that year. Back then in Enugu, what is wrong with my gender? I mean, what is wrong with men? Um, hold on. I don't know. I don't know. My woman is here. Okay, Lisa, see what will happen here. Go to the room and wait for me. I'm coming here. Eric, please. I am coming back to settle this matter. Please. The only crime I ever committed was helping you and then falling in love with you. Live my life. Live my life. I'm warning you. Live my life. Live which life? Which life? See, let me tell you something. If you think I'm going to live your life, then think again. It is me and you in this forever. We are stuck together. Since you said I ruined your life and you ruined my life, we ruin everything together. Let everything Kukuma spoil. Why you need to do what I told you. I was telling you, when I got to the mall, they didn't even attend to me. I was so, so worried. Like, who does that? Angel. Angel, don't tell me you're thinking. 
Michael wouldn't be. Who? Lisa was nice to me from childhood. To growing up, to come, to PPA. Does it matter? Does it matter? I hope they now live with them, Nidu. Just let them be. When I feel for Lisa, I mean, in her condition, I. I really feel for her. I saw Eric. He paid my bride price, you know. What would I tell his mother who has always wanted him to have a child? What would I tell her? Angel, if you were the one that cheated on Eric, will he forgive you? Anyway. It's your case, so I'll just let you handle it the way you want. No, I can't take it. Listen, if you want them to be in this house, then I would have to go back to my parents' house. What is wrong with you, baby? What is wrong with you? Don't you know Eric and what he has done for me? I know. But baby, we are getting married soon. Huh? How is he supposed to be here with his woman? No. Not now I'm done with NYSE. I want my privacy with my man alone. Let me ask you. What happens to me? Walking around the house naked the way I used to. Huh? Just because one pregnant girl is in my, husband's, my, my man's house with her man. I don't want that. What is it? Let me ask you, what if I am the one in his condition? <laughs> you cannot be the one in this condition. You can't. Because I wouldn't even want to settle for less. <sighs> Do the needful. Yes, by tomorrow, I'll be leaving your house. I ever had a conversation with your girl. We'll leave. I wouldn't want you to lose your girl because of us. Eric, you both are not going anywhere. This is my house. Don't worry. I already spoke to Lisa. We'll go back to the village and stay with my mother. Okay? At least she, she's um, buoyant enough. I'm sure she can take care of us until I get my hands busy. Okay? No, hold on. Hold on, hold on. No, hold on. Just hold on. Baby, I'm sorry for everything. I know all this. All this are happening because of me. I'm sorry. Let's go back. My son. How are you? Fine, you're welcome. Thank you very much. So, you still haven't told me who this woman is. Mama, focus on me. I'm your son. Eh? <laughs> focus I know on me. you are my son, and I know your wife. But I don't know this particular woman here. That's the reason why I am not seeing you. All right, Mama, this woman here is um, my wife. Wife? Yes. I know you want a grandchild so badly. So, um, she's carrying my child. She's my new wife. Wait, what about Angel? Mama, do you want a woman who will give you a grandchild or you want a woman who will give you money? Which one do you want? Choose one. Now. Okay. Now you are welcome. 
Thank you, Mama. not your Thank welcome. you very much. Go, go inside and bring out um, Ophio Boroko. Let uh, us eat. I will not do it. But I have to welcome her first. Uh, she, has, she has heard you. Go and bring Ophio Boroko. You are misbehaving in this house. I can never forgive you. Hey. Mark my word today. I will never forgive you. They have left the house for you. They have left the house for you. Now you can walk around naked. Yes. They have gone. Walk around naked, that's what you want. Baby, I don't like the way you talk. Oh. Eh? What did I do? Remember I gave you two options. Two options, oh. Either they stay and I leave. Or they leave and I stay. <laughs> Are you mad? Do you want me to send you out of this house myself? Do you know if I were in Eric's shoe, he would have done better for me. Now you've sent them out of my house. Okay. Did you not agree to leave? What is it? Eh? What did I do? See, if you want me to leave, I will leave. You are not the only man on earth. And besides, I am not an ugly girl. Oh. Really? Now I understand you have someone else. You have another man outside that you are seeing. Eh? But you know what? Go inside that house, that room. Pick up your things and leave my house now. What? Yes. <laughs> because of Eric. Who is that? What is it? What do you want? What do you want? Your boyfriend is no longer here. Give her space! What? Ah. What, what, what is going on? I cannot say this place is not conducive enough for me to sit. Sorry, I've come to see um, Lisa and, and my husband. Where are they? They've gone to the village this morning. Why? Are you asking me why? Are you asking me? Yes. Well, I was not expecting this question from you. But Eric has come to take his responsibilities. He's now a changed man. He's, he's now in the village. So? Please, um, can you tell them to pick my calls? They're not picking my calls. I mean, I regret my actions. I shouldn't have done what I did. I am sorry, but I cannot reach him now. He has gone to the village. So, yeah. I can't help now. My son, I am so happy that you have proven to the world that you are a real man. I'm so happy. Emma, I've, um, I've discovered myself. And I've made up my mind to stay with Lisa. Okay? I just need you to help us. Help us until I bounce back. Huh? My son, you don't have to beg me. I'm your mother. I will do everything possible to make sure that I take care of you, take care of your wife, and even the unborn child. If I do not do it, who else will do it? Hmm. Huh? Thank you and very much. as for Angel, I will send message across to her people so that the dowry they will return it back. Hmm. I will take care of you, your wife, and your unborn child. Thank you very okay. much. Thank you so much. Don't worry, I work so hard. I'll make sure Lisa and I don't stay too long. You want also? Mm -hmm. You want also? <laughs> oh, we're bad. Thank you very much. Thank you. I want about that soup you made last night. You know, that soup was so nice. Uh, yeah. You can actually leave. My guy, calm down. Calm down. She has realized there's no husband anywhere. Yes. So please, when she comes back, listen to her very well. Yes, you guys should talk very well. You know, all I want for you guys is just a happy home. Yes. I want you and your wife to be happy in your marriage. Okay, now. Nah. I'll come to the village and see you guys. Yes. What's going on here? I am leaving. You think I was joking when I said it? Hold on. You mean you are leaving my house just because of that little argument? Yes! Oh. Yes! Since you want to fight me because of your friend and his wife, then I will leave. 
Go find yourself another girlfriend. Hmm, okay. Now, I've come to understand that you're letting me know that you have a boyfriend somewhere. Right? No problem. You can go and meet your boyfriend outside. But please, don't come back to me. Don't come back to go and beg me. Don't try it. What? Now, go. Leave. Leave, leave my house. Uh, babe, I only wanted to prank you. I was not serious. You want me to leave? You wanted to prank me. Yes. Now go to the village and prank your parents. Go prank your papa. Honey, please right. now. Leave, leave my house now. Please. I'll push you. Please. Leave my house. Please Come now. On. I was only joking. Leave my house. Honey, I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. I mean, I shouldn't have reacted the way I did. I just, I don't know. I don't just know what to say. Lisa, you know you've really been good to me. You've been wonderful, Adi. I don't have any reason to, to, to react the way I did it. It's so bad. I'm here to say I'm sorry, honey. Mama, help me beg them, Mama. I am sorry. Please, you don't have to beg me to forgive. Or you don't have to beg me to tell him to forgive you. If you know whatever thing you have to do to get yourself a good husband, do it. As I speak now, we will come for our dowry. Mama, no, he hasn't got into this. That's why I'm here. I'm, okay, I'm here to say, honey, please marry the both of us. Listen, I'll... I'm okay with it. I don't have a problem. I cannot give him a child. You have, you're carrying his child. I don't have a problem with it. Please don't say no. Jeez. Major. First of all, I should be the one. I mean, we should be the one apologizing to you. Before anything, we wronged you. I was supposed to be your sister. I was supposed to have your back. And Eric was supposed to be your husband. Or rather, we betrayed you. Please. I am sorry. Stop going around breaking hearts. Stop playing games. Ooh. Cause you don't know what life was for you yeah. This life is full of mysteries What goes around must come around Oh, oh, oh Oh, oh, oh Ooh. Sister again You are too stubborn, that's one thing about you You are too stubborn You better call me and beg him you have to. He's not even picking my calls. Nika, why did I even do this? What have I done? I can't lose Nedu. Eh? How can I lose him now? How? Hey, God. I always told you this. Every time you, ha you always do your things strong head. You have to be coming down. You have to. You have to. God, I don't want to lose Nedu, eh? I have suffered for him, and he has suffered for me too. I can't lose him now. I can't. Please, don't let this happen. Sis, you would have allowed those people to be in his house. What is there? If they were in your shoes, they will still do the same thing for you. I know. You have to calm down. Mika, I know. But if I remember what I passed through with Nedu in his village with that nurse, I feel so insecure with my man. Eh? I don't want to lose him. I don't I don't want to hear stories, not with anybody. I, I can't lose Nedu now. I can't. Sister, with a pregnant woman. <laughs> 
You told me she's pregnant, right? I know. She's pregnant. I, I know all of that, but... Uh, God. They do wherever you are. Wherever you are. Remember our pastor. Eh? Mm. Baby, I'm so tired. Me too. <laughs> oh, baby, eh? mm -hmm. today, mm. today you're going to show me how strong that you are. Mm. Huh? Today you're going to show me. Let me know if you can be able to do all these farm jobs with me when we get married. <laughs> Maybe you do not need to doubt it all. Don't worry. I'll prove myself to you at the farm. It's okay. It's okay. You know, in this village, a lot of ladies in this village, mm. they are very strong and hardworking. That's why they want me to marry them. But it's you that I choose. Because I am Obi. more hardworking than them. Obi. Yes, Obi. now. I believe you. I'm more hardworking than them. So don't worry. You see me in action today. I'm fine. Yes, that's my baby. Because I do not want any of them to get close to you. <laughs> baby! Honey, mm? Obim, mm. this is our cassava farmland. Mm. You know, as the only person around, I have to be coming to the village to come and weed it. It's my late mother's cassava <gasps> land. Baby, yes. mm? you don't have anything to worry about. Mm? As long as I'm here, I will always come to help you. So, Baby, it's okay, but you better help me. Please, help me. Because, you know, in this village, they know how to monitor people. <laughs> now, they'll be observing you to know whether this girl they do brought home is hard working or not. So yeah. please, you better help me. Baby, you see it yourself. Huh? Yes. And besides, I'm not from the city. I also have a village where I come from. Yes, that's true. So let's get to work. So I'm starting from here. Start from there. Okay. I don't know, I don't know. I don't know if it's a snake, please hold my leg. A snake from where? Please tie it by my leg. I don't want to die. Please, wait, please. Ah, you will like tie it. I won't let you now. I don't know what. Babe, please look for help. Please, please. I don't want to die. Please, let me run, run down for help. Oh, 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 okay, calm down, relax. Ay, let me, my let me take you home. Ah, no, please, baby. I cannot go home now. I like to spend me, please. Please, please. Look for help now, please. I don't want to die. Ah, just be I'm coming. My leg go. Please run, run, run. I don't want to die. Ay. Ha. My name is Ella. I'm Nidu's wife to be. Okay. Please, 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 nurse. We need your help, like right now, please. Just come My help? Me. Yes. What is wrong with him? I don't know. I don't know if it was a snake bite or I don't know. I don't know. Please, you just need to come with okay, me right now. Okay, where is he now? He's at the farm. Uh, let's go, let's Thank go. Thank you. Ay, <laughs> ay. Maybe she'll be okay. Sorry. <laughs> Ah. Sorry, no. Nidu, what is it? Because I don't know. I don't know. I think it's neck that bites me. Please do something about Calm it. Calm down, please. don't worry. Don't worry. Ah, I don't want to die. Please no, do something. Uh, I'm doing it. Uh, Nidu, yes. I will need um, water and palm oil. What? Baby? Okay. Please get water and palm oil now. Please rush. Okay. Please, please. Okay. Be fast. I don't want to die. No, please do something. Uh, you'll be fine. <sighs> So you'll be fine. Um, you'll see to let me examine other places to see okay. if you're okay. okay. Eh? Um, can, can you stand? Yes, I can manage. Okay. Oh. Let me examine, you know, I need to examine other places like this to check if you're okay. Eh? Now, eh? How did I forget the key? I can't even break the door. I have to go and collect the key. I hope it's fine. Oh, God. Do 
Oh. Is he a pain you? Ah, no, 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 you rise me. You rise me. Did you if I rise you, is it bad? Eh? No, it's not bad now. Let's leave this thing. Please, let's leave it now before this girl will get here. Baby! Um. Ah, sorry. This leg is. Sorry. Oh yeah, why is it? I, I, I forgot. I forgot the key. Ah. It's in your pocket. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. No, so you'll be, be fine. It. Yes, you will be fine. Don't worry. Okay. Just get the. Uh, hey, please what go, 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 go. Don't worry. Ah. Maybe now that she has gone, I can make you feel alright. Yeah? No, no, ah, no, no, so wait now, wait, mm -hmm. please now. See, see, let me tell you. We can wait, we can see some other time and discuss about this. I don't want this girl to meet us there. I need your So, Baby. Yeah. What happened? Baby, the nurse prefers that I go home. That bush is not safe for me. Better. Um, nurse, yeah. please, eh? I'll take it from you, okay? Thank you very much. Okay. In that case, I will have to go home. She's not going to treat him again. I will. I just want to get to the house to get some injections and drugs for him. Okay. Okay, we'll be waiting for your turn, okay? All right, no nurse, problem. nurse, please come back, oh, please. Nidu, don't worry, I will come back now, no, eh? Let me just, please. don't worry, you'll be fine. Please don't take too long, oh. No, don't, let me just get the answer. Okay. okay, please, please. Thank you. Nurse, please come back, oh. Sorry, you'll be fine. Yes. Huh? Sorry. Baby, sorry, okay? You'll be fine. Yeah? Okay, sorry. Baby. Okay, baby. But baby, please. I don't like the way you react to nurse. You know she's the one treating me. What if she gets angry and leave me? Are you going to treat me? Why would she get angry? I don't like the way she was holding you. Eh? Anyways, I'm sorry. I'm here now. Nidon, how are you feeling now? Because I'm not feeling fine. I'm not feeling fine. Yeah, because I need injection. So this can stop. The pain is too much, please. Don't worry, after the injection, you'll be okay. Eh? Okay. okay. And that reminds me, baby. Mm -hmm. We forgot our cutlass at the farm. That's true. Yes. Go and get it. Now? Yes, go now and get it. Baby. Before someone will pick it. Don't worry, let her go. Hmm? No, baby, please, go now. Go now. Like right pick. now? Yes, go, please. Ah. Sorry. Okay. okay, let me go and get it. Okay. Um, nurse. No, eh? Please take care of him, okay? No problem, I will. I'll be right back. Okay. Baby, go, 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 go. Please, please go, be fast, eh? Okay. Go, go, go. Sorry, eh? Don't worry, you won't get to do something, eh? Let me just... Uh... I'm not comfortable with this nurse of a girl. She seems to be seducing my man. <sighs> if I react now, Edo will be angry. What do I do? Sh should I should I run back? Oh. Mm -mm. No. Let me let me quickly run to the farm, get the cutlass, and then go back home. Yes, let me go. Ah. Sorry, ah. I'm done. Okay, okay, okay. You're okay. fine. Okay. Baby, I'm back. Sorry. Baby, did yeah. you get it? Yes, it's at the backyard. Is she done? No, no, she's not done. Ah, since that time. Do you have any food in this house? No, there is no food in this house, but I can quickly go inside and prepare something for him to no, eat. No, baby, that will waste time, please. Just rush outside. Go to Mama Ngozi's place and get food for me now, please. Mm, baby, no. <laughs> I'm tired, eh? I can't, please. Baby, stop this now. Stop. Go and get me food. Just go, please. I. Baby, I can't go. I'm sorry. I can't. Do you want your man to die? Why would you even say that, eh? Baby, stop this the, now. The thing is, I'm exhausted. I've been running up and down since morning. I need to rest. 
Oh, please, just go. Just go and get me food. No, I just took injection now. And I need food now. Please, now. Just go, okay? It's fine. I will go. Sorry. Okay, thank you. Let's go. Let me go. Okay, baby. Um, thank no, you. Please be careful. No problem. No problem. Let me go and get the food. Oh. Nurse, mm? you're going? Um, yes, but I will come back. When he's done eating, he will call me. Chai. Mm. You're a nice person. It's my job Thank now. You. I'm just doing my job. You're welcome. Okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. All right, uh -huh. <laughs> right. Oh, right now. Uh, bye bye. bye, -bye. Uh -huh. Hmm. Nurse, why haven't I seen this beauty in you all this while? I didn't even know you are this beautiful. Come on. I'm back. Okay, welcome, baby. Thank you. Um, I saw the nurse. Yes. Um, what happened? She said she will come back when I'm done eating. Uh, yes. Okay. Um, how are you now? Maybe I'm fine. The pain is reducing. Oh, yes. Good. I'm not feeling that much pain again. Thank God, do. Oh. Okay, baby, let's so, go inside yeah. and eat now. Let's you don't want to eat here? No, no, no. Okay, no let's problem. Go let's go. Baby. Yes. I want to ask. Feel free. Am I not beautiful enough? I don't understand. Why are you asking? No, I want to know. Is the nurse more beautiful than me? Of course not. She's not. Okay. Since you've answered my question, I'll just go inside the house. How did she? Wow, what kind of question is this? I don't understand. <laughs> it's not so more beautiful than me, I don't understand. This is it. This is what you do. Huh? Honey, I am sorry. It's not what you think, please. Why are you calling her, honey? I thought you said she's going. It is you that we go. You slapped me. And I will slap you again. What you slapped me? I said I will slap you. Ah! 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 Stop! No, 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 Oh, you want to kill my older sister for me? No, you want to kill my older sister? If you kill my older sister, who will be with me? Who will take care of me? Who now? Neka. Neka, I'm sorry. I don't want to kill your only sister for you. I don't know why all this temptation is coming my way. I don't know. Because she wants to leave me and follow that nurse. <laughs> Nidu, you are a goat. A very big goat. Eh? Since I know you, I have never met with any other man. But you want to leave me and follow that nurse, Abi? Ah, God will judge you. They do God will judge you. In fact, you see this thing between the both of us? It is over. Over. I am done. 
Please, I'm sorry. Ah, baby, we don't say this now. Don't call me a goat. I'm not a goat. In fact, I don't even have anything to do with her. Really? Yes. After she has broken my head. And do? After she has broken my head, right? <laughs> Just tell her to get ready for me. Oh. Once I recover, this fight continues. It is not over. Eh? No. Just tell her. No, baby. Don't say that. I don't want you to continue any fight with anybody. Please. Because first thing tomorrow morning, I am leaving this village. And you are going with me. So, girls, that's good for you. Yes. Wow. Now you come. You can sit. Ready, sit down. Philo, I'm tired though, eh? We've been standing here for over 30 minutes. Are you sure this cabman is still going to come? Ella, calm down now. You two, they para. Calm down, please. There is nothing you're going to do at that, at that house. I know you just want to go back and start talking with your boyfriend, maybe. Hmm. Thank God you know. <laughs> Man, that lecturer is really getting on my nerves. I'm telling you. That man should better take his time more. It shouldn't be a problem in this final year. I know what he wants. He just wants to graze you on his bed. God forbid. I match it. God forbid. I'd rather have a carryover that, than sleep with that man. What? Carryover? Mm -hmm. For final year? Yes. Are you okay? Have you forgotten that is extra school fees you're talking about? I don't care. I'd rather, I'd rather have a carry over than sleep with that old man. I can't do that. You better stop saying that. I'm not still saying it. I cannot sleep with that old man, please. Oh, look who we have here. Who is that? <laughs> Hello, beautiful ladies. How are you doing? I'm fine. Good afternoon, Good afternoon, pretty one. How are you? I'm fine. Ella, have you seen how girls work? <laughs> um, please, you, can you take us home? Come on, you don't need to answer that. I will gladly oblige. <laughs> Come on, let's let's hop in. Let's go. Come on, put this matter that fix, please. To the front, front seat. Please. You enter. Hey, come on. The front suits you. Thanks. It's okay. Please, it's okay. Yeah, we're here already. <laughs> Thank you so much for dropping us. It's okay. You're welcome. Thank you, Jude. You're welcome. It's all right. Ah, please, let me talk to you. Just a minute. You want to have a word with me? Yes, just a minute. Is that a problem? Um, listen, I'm very, very hungry, okay? Let us wait till tomorrow, please. Ella. Ella, please. Hear him out first now. At least hear what he's going to say. Do you know what? I'll be inside. Wait. Okay, what is it? Um, please. You need to be very fast. I'm hungry, okay? I understand that, okay? You know what? Uh, I will just give you the chance to go in. Fresh enough. Let me take you to a nice restaurant. Here we can eat, then have a good shot. What do you think? Thank you, Bono. Thanks. I have a delicious food at home. Ella, why are you being hard on me? I believe your friend might have told you how much I love you. I've told her. I love you so much. Why are you doing this to me? <laughs> you love me. And my friend, 
is the one to know about it. Come on, Ella. I've been looking for the opportunity for which to have a good conversation. But you've not been obliging me. I love you. And that is the reason I have to talk to your friend, to talk to you. Is that bad? It's okay, it's fine. So, is that why you stopped me? Ella, I love you. I really need to love you. Alright? And I want you to give me the opportunity for me to take care of you. I truly love you. And I want to be there for you. Please. Listen. Eh? I cannot stand here to have this conversation right now with you, okay? I am famished. Thanks for the ride. You know what? Let me, give you, let me just transfer for you so you can have something nice to eat, alright? Like I said before, thank you. I don't need it. I have told you countless times that I have a boyfriend. I don't know how long I'll keep saying it to you. Ella! I understand you have a boyfriend. I'm not disputing that. Listen, I'm not here for a child play. This is Jude. Alright? You are your final year. I'm very sure you should be graduating. Are we talking about being a boyfriend or girlfriend? I'm ready to take this relationship to the next level. You should be talking about marriage. Yes! And that wow. is why I'm here. Really? Not just a male relationship boyfriend. We don't do that. I want to love you. I want to marry you. I want to make you happy. So what makes you think that my relationship is heading nowhere? Wait! Why is it that men you men, like men like you, Jude, are the ones that makes women feel they are not doing the right thing with your man. Huh? Now listen, nothing is going to work between us. Leave me alone! Ella! 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 Ella. I don't like this. Hey, what's meaning of that now? What have I done? What is it? You're asking me what you just did. Huh? So, you and this guy have plans. And that was why you lied to me. That you called a cabman to come pick us up from school. So Judy is the cabman, right? Ella, stop talking like a child. <laughs> if he wanted to take us out just so he could talk to you, he would have come to the school rather. Listen, tell him I am not interested. Philo, you know I have me do now, eh? You know I have Nidu, and I don't like it when a man stalks me. It gets me angry. Nidu and I love each other, and that's all that matters. You better go out there and tell him so he can go. Do you know you don't have sense? <laughs> really? You've been dating this guy for God knows how long. Tell me, what stopped him from marrying you? You know you're about graduating, right? Mm -hmm. And I told you that I and Nidu have plans. Nidu promised me that once I graduate from school, he will come see my people. He will make it official. The both of us will get married. You know that, and I told you. See. The way you're carrying this guy for head right now. Make sure he marries you all, because I don't want you to come back in the future crying to me, telling me all sorts of things about this same guy that you're proud of today. Come on, Ella. This guy is good looking. He is rich. He will take care of you. Just say yes to him. Then you marry him now, eh? Philo, marry him. I don't want. Of Mas, you know I cannot marry him. Oh. He knows the person I'm dating. Okay. Yes, if I told you he did not know who I'm dating, I would have gone ahead. That's if he likes me. I am your friend. I cannot tell you or advise you wrongly. See, you cannot put your ex in one basket. No girl nowadays dates one boyfriend. Get it? And you know I can't do that, right? Philo, you know I cannot double date. And I'm not going to start now. I'd rather put my ex in one basket and watch them with my body and soul. You better go out there and tell him that I do not want him. Please. Ella. Because the next time he will stalk me, <laughs> the next time he will stalk me on the road to say rubbish, I will insult the hell out of his life. Better go out there and tell him. I would rather tell him to leave me alone. Jude, I'm so sorry. I don't know what is wrong with this girl. She keep pissing me off all the time. Listen, so many guys have come to her for a relationship, but she keeps turning them down. I, I don't know what you guys see in her. I love her. I love her. Do all you can, please. Please. I love her so much. Why her now? I have... Okay, fine. Let me calm down. I have beautiful classmates. I can just invite you and then you stylishly look at them 
And then choose anyone you like, I'll get it for you. I don't want any other girl. Please, understand me. If I love someone, I put my heart, my mind on that person. I cannot do it. But she is not interested. See, she has a guy she's in love with. Both of them are in love with each other and she's not ready to give up for any other guy. I am tired of all this. I don't want this to make me have a problem with her because if should that happen, I will just send her out of my house. Ha, has it gotten to that? Yes, it has gotten to that. It has gotten to that. She's just a poor girl from a poor home and she can't come here and be giving me stress. Enough of all this now. Even the so-called guy she's bragging about can't even afford her 5,000 naira, no matter how she begs. You know what? I will spoil her with money. Yes, that is what I will do. And as for you, if you can convince her, talk to her, and make her accept me, I will give you 200k. I'm not joking. I'm Jude. And you know I can do more than that. And I will give you 500,000 to give to her. Or better still, you can just get her account number. Let me transfer direct, or I'll transfer to you. Anything just to get her. All this for love? Of course, if I love someone, I go extra mile. I can do anything. What if she doesn't accept it? She don't have a choice. Of course, we've talked here. She says she's hungry, that uh, uh, she's going inside and you people cook delicious food. Eh? Yeah. Jeez, so this girl can lie. This girl can... She, she told you that? That is what she told me. Hey. What is wrong with it? There's no, no... Nothing is in the house, so no food, though. I should just miss this opportunity. I should, at least she would have followed you out now and come back with, uh, with package, my package as well. It'd be like say this girl now, Winshaw. What no, is no, all no, this? No, 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 she's not no, no, no but, but. You don't have to see. Her. If you are in a shoe, you will do worse. Of course, if you don't like a man, you will not like to take anything from that man. I'm not disputing that fat. But listen, I love her. And I want you to make her to love me. I will do everything. All right? You know what? Let's go so I can. We can get something to eat, also to give to her, all right? You can get her account number so I can transfer some money to you, 500k, as I said, to you. Yes. Oh, you, you wanted this? So, so sending all, all that money to of her? Of course. <laughs> you don't have to worry, eh? I'm here. Hmm? Just do me a favor. Transfer all that money to my account. Okay. I will settle that. That one is not a problem. I will make sure she is yours. Then we don't have a problem Yes. Here. Let's go. Listen to me. Let me promise you something. If this girl accepts me, I will make sure I pay her final year school fees. Huh? Yes, I will do that. I will pay her clearance fees. And listen, I will even do more. Both of you will choose a state that you know you can serve. Your, you can do your youth service well. I will work it out. You do? I, are you serious right now? Of you, 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 course, you, I will do more. Listen, you don't get it. This whole thing is blowing off my brain right now. Don't let me leave my boyfriend for you. No, 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 no. Please, 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 please. That is my friend. I don't want anybody to cut off my neck. You know what? Get to the car. All right? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Hello, my beautiful Ella. How are you? Now you listen, Mr. Man. Do not mention my name. I don't want to see you and I do not want to talk to you. Don't come close to me. Yella, what has come over you? I mean, why are you talking to me in such a rude manner? Is everything alright with you? I told you I have a boyfriend, right? <laughs> of course, that is not in news. Of course, that is not in news. Now you listen to me, Jude. I am not interested in whatever you or my roommate want from me. The next time you will stop me, and say this nonsense again. I promise you I will so insult the hell out of you. You said what? You heard me. How dare you talk to me in such a rude manner? Are you insane? Are you mad? Now you listen to me. Look at me very well. No, just, just, just take... Look at me. Look at me very well. How do I look? I look classic, right? Yeah! <laughs> Now I'm listing and listing very good. Don't you ever in your miserable life, in your God-forsaken life, in your daft life, see me and try to insult me again. Alright? What are we even talking about? Your boyfriend. Can your boyfriend stand me? Just look at me very well. Your, 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 your idiotic boyfriend? Yes? Your doubts? That poor thing? Good for nothing imbecile. 
you want to compare him with me? No, you can't do that. No, no, you just can't do that. You can't insult me. Do you understand that? I just want to clean you up and make you my wife. And you are here doing your Buga thing. Just look at you. Now listen, you are poor. Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. You are not just poor, you are rich. You are nothing. Alright? Now listen and listen very good. You see that money I sent to your friend to give to you? I want you to send that 500,000 back to your friend. I want my money back. You shut up your mouth. If I'm talking, you keep quiet and listen to me. And my food. <laughs> The food I bought for you, of course I know you've eaten the food. That's why you have the mouth to talk nonsense. No problem. But you see my money? I don't choke with my money. For the record, you are a poor idiot. Wait, though. Did he just say he gave me 500,000 naira? And he even bought food for me. Is that where Philo has been getting all the money she... <sighs> okay. It's either Philo killed me today or I kill her. Akwatata, something must happen. What is it? Why are you shouting my name up and down? <laughs> Listen, I would have started with a dirty slap. What? Yes! But then, answer me. Did you collect 500,000 naira from that Mugu friend of yours? Answer me! See, I... I don't, I, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Listen, babe. Hmm? If you do not answer me, we are going to fall out. Because Jude saw me just now. Insulted me that I collected this... 500,000 naira, yet I do not want to be his girlfriend. Did you collect the money? Ella, he did not give me anything. You're a liar. Philo, you know you are lying. Where did you get the food you were eating yesterday? The food he bought for me, right? Ella, what is your problem? <laughs> no, tell me, what exactly is your problem? Do you want this man or not? If you don't want him, what concerns you with the food and his money? What? See, I don't have time for this rubbish right now. I have a lot to do. Excuse me, I have something. Listen, do not let me smack you. Philo, do not let me smack you. Answer me. <laughs> Where did you get the money you've been spending last night? Did you just off the tap? <laughs> are, you, are you mad? It is you who is mad. <laughs> hey, Philo, I know you. I know what you are capable of. And I do not want to ask you again. Philo, where did you get all the money you've been spending? Answer me! How did you get the money you've been spending? All through last night. Is that your papa? Your papa money? Yes, now the money where your papa give me now is pain. What is wrong with you? Are you okay? You, you don't want a man, but you want his money. Long cartoon won't kill you. Did you just slap me? And I will slap the hell out of you again. <laughs> hey, Jesus. Philo, you just slapped me. <laughs> I don't understand. You don't want man. But you want this money. You slapped me. You feel like, you feel like you don't know me. <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? What is happening here? Will you stop that? Thank God you're here. What is going on here? I said thank God you're here. Thank God you are here. Now, say it to my face. Did you give her the 500,000 naira to give to me? What exactly is the problem here? Philo, did you not give her the money I sent to, for you to give to her? The 500,000 and the food? She did not want it. What? what was I supposed to do? She did not want it. Uh-uh. Wait, wait. So here is my money and wait, the food. Wait, wait, wait. Did you just say I did not want it? Philo, you just told me now that you did not give you any money. Philo, why are you like this? Why are you lying? Now listen, Jude. This will be a proof to you that I did not collect your money, neither did I eat your food. So the next time, you will see me on the road to say nonsense to me. <laughs> I will so insult you that you will never forget in a hurry. Better collect your money from her. She's leaving my house. As for you, we have to go to 
You are leaving my house! Oh! It's yours! No. She's leaving! She's leaving! Oh, she's leaving my house! That is not my business! Hey, hey, listen! Whether she's leaving your house or not, that is not my business! So you mean you actually took money from me? Took the food? Without delivering your job? You did not even convince her! You didn't talk to her! Right? Here is my money, and here is my food. Oh, you have the mind to ask me of your money? Hmm? See, let me tell you one thing. You see all this relationship stuff? The stress that you have put me through. You don't be past that money when you send for my accounts. You didn't hear me so? You don't be past them. I want but my calm money down, back. calm down, okay? Calm down, not they shout for my ear. Don't say I be good girl, I go, I, I go give you your money. I go send your money, give you, not they shout. I want a transfer now. Oh. You are going to give all my money. Everything I spent. Let me ask you one thing. No, just one thing. Did I beg you to send that money to me? Did I? Are you sending me my money or not? Then stop shouting and be patient. Be patient, I will send you your money. Please send me your account number, babe. Come on, for road. See, if you don't want, I will pull you out. Till now, I couldn't find peace with Nidu. <laughs> Neka. Is this not a sign from God that we are not meant to be together? Sister, no. Don't say that. <sighs> Don't. Sister, you know you single-handedly ten years school. What you need to do is to beg him. You need to. That's what you have to do, sister. He's not even picking my cause. He's not taking any of my cause. Eh? He's not. God. Please don't let this happen, no. Eh? Relationship of how many of how many years to just go down like that? I'll kill myself. No, I mean, sis. You are no. not you, you will not do it, not when I'm here. You will not. <laughs> okay, don't worry. I will call you. I will beg on your behalf. You have to calm down, please. Be fine for me, please now. Sister, calm down, please. It's okay. Oh, which kind man it is? Onye mazima do nebulu ma 